Last week, I talked about the storied Cubs-Cards rivalry because they're playing each other in the London series in June. There were players and managers who played on both sides of the rivalry, and even legendary broadcaster Harry Carey broadcast games for both teams. But a trade between the Cubs and the Cards stands out as one of the most lopsided deals in MLB history. In 1964, the Cards sent Ernie Brolio, one of the NL's best pitchers at the time, to the Cubs for left fielder Lou Brock. It was a six-player deal, but Brock and Brolio were the headliners. At the time of the trade, Brock was a 251 hitter, but he was about to take off. He hit 348 with 33 stolen bases for the Cards for the rest of the 64 season, and the Cards beat the Yankees in the World Series. Brock would go on to become the greatest base stealer in MLB history up to that point with 938 career stolen bases. He also had over 3,000 hits. Lou Brock's in the Hall of Fame. Ernie Brolio, on the other hand, derailed. He had elbow surgery after the 64 season. He went 1-6 in 65 and 2-6 in 66. Then he retired. The Brock Brolio trade is just another chapter in the long story of the Cubs-Cardinals rivalry. I'm Kelly Franco Troop, and that's your three-inning minute.